As our Febramon suffered, without a true monarch to guide her and her people. Decades have passed since last His Majesty Erland sat atop the Draken throne. Long have we endured, yet it has not been for naught. At last, the bell has tolled on the age of the Consul. At last, we may celebrate the coming of our rightful ruler. The return of the Sovereign. <laughs> My word, such an inspiring visage. Your Majesty shall have my eternal yeah, fealty. No Your Majesty, of oh, how long I have awaited this moment. the rightful inheritor of the Draken Throne, chosen by the dragon as its enemy. Behold and rejoice! Fortune has delivered us our savior at last! At last! Praise be, for only the Sovereign's guidance can lead us true. All hail the Sovereign! All hail! Let all present pledge their allegiance to the Sovereign let us be united in the hope that our legions reign will near end. Long live the Sovereign of Ramon! Long live the Sovereign! Arisen, thou who wouldst slay the dragon, if thou seekest to behold this world in its true aspect, abandon thy reason. Cast aside thine heart and thy life both. I ask thee to demonstrate thy will, for naught but thine ambition can alter the course of the rivers of fate. Which one of you was it? No need to be shy. I've just got to take down a record of your name and face. Come on, step forward. Aha! I thought I recognized you. Ha, ha, ha. 
I ill like that look in your eyes. Tis queerly brazen for a pawn. Most of your kind have eyes blank as a cadaver's. Mayhap tis only natural seeing as how you rise from the dead. There's aught different about you, though. Could it be that you fear death just as we mortals do? Worry not, Vessel. Three days here, and you'll be longing for death's sweet embrace. Come along, you feckless dullards! Would you take pity on me, sir? Injuries pain you. Pray, do not overexert yourself. This is no place for one of your ilk. Tis harsh beyond measure. Even we pawns are pushed to the brink. You ought not anger the overseer. Let us proceed to the site. Time for you to get to work. You are prepared to work. Then you all begin by carrying stones out from the station in the back and bringing them here. is quite cluttered. Pray leave. A job well done. Now the next step is to What is this commotion? Perhaps we ought to investigate. Get me 
Should the battle turn dire, keep in mind that you do have the Boulders, barrels, and the like can make effective weapons for the clever combatant. could survive a fall from this height. Not even a pawn.
Keep your distance, Arisa. Worry not for me. The grind may swallow me whole, but I will not perish. There is a stone not far from here, known as a Rift Stone. Pray, seek it out. If you're truly the Arisen, then our paths will surely cross again. Oi! Are you all right? What happened here? A griffin appears one moment and falls the next. And now you stand before me. Was it you then? The one who was riding on its back? It is a wonder you survived. Accompany me to the stronghold. We'll treat your wounds and hear your story. Still, I can hardly believe it. A griffin of all things here. Add to that the recent dragon sighting. It is said that the arrival of the Sovereign portends an age of peace, yet only trouble has followed. What does it all mean? I had thought being in the Border Watch would make for easy work, but the wind's beginning to blow in a fell direction. Where exactly is this jail you say you escaped from, anyway? I've never heard of such a place. There's certainly naught like that here in Burma. Could it be you were held in the neighboring country of Qatar? Nay, I suppose that's unlikely. We've been estranged from Batal ever since the war. It is difficult to imagine any citizen of Burma being sent there. Fine! Goblins! Let's take up your weapon, sir! You'll be needing it! If you find your strength flat, buy the curative or have a bit of green polish. When one of the fiends comes in, best guard will lodge, else you'll be sore on the morrow. Make use of the slope. It will give you an advantage against their ranks. Boy guarded attacks to get the enemy to flinch. Panda attacks are more destructive but will leave you vulnerable. There are oft items to be scavenged from the bodies of monsters and their ilk. If you're not squeamish about picking at their bones, that is. Have you beheld the dragon? I've not. I count that a blessing. All I know for sure is that it is a beast ever more fearsome than a griffin. One need only look to the miserable state of the village of Mel to see that. We can but hope that the Sovereign will rid us of it ere long. <laughs> among the people and steps forth to challenge it. I dare say Vermin owes much of its prosperity to the sovereigns who have served it over time. Though, personally, I'm just glad to know we've got someone looking out for us. Welcome, Arisen. We pawns have long awaited your arrival. What is this? The pawns. They bend the knee to you so readily, but then... No. Surely you cannot be the Arisen. You seek the Riftstone, do you not? We can take you to it. Pray. Come this way.
Before you stands a rift stone. Tis a gate by which we of the Pawn Legion may cross Ur into this world. Pray, summon your pawn. Simply paint with your mind's eye the loyal attendant whom you would have serve you. People here are evacuated and safe for the moment.
This world is connected to innumerable other realms beyond the rift, which pawns, such as myself, are able to traverse. My kind is duty-bound to serve you, Arisen, and to use the knowledge we glean in these distant worlds to your benefit. I myself look forward to traveling alongside you and using my experiences beyond the rift to enrich your adventures. Well, I'll be a pawn summoning before my very eyes. You truly are the Arisen, then. Strange. I thought the Arisen was in the capital. Surely there's only meant to be one Arisen. Fie, this is all beyond my ken. The Watchhead would know what to do, I'm sure. Though, as luck would have it, he's away. I suppose we'll save any further questions till the Watchhead returns. You're free to do as you like afore then. What? You've no memories, you say? Mayhap you could make for Melv, then. It was set upon by the dragon not long ago. The Arisen is said to bear some deep connection to the dragon. Should you be Arisen, mayhap you'll recall aught of import there. Hail, Arisen. Pray, ask aught you wish to know. I shall answer, if tis within my power to do so. Very well. May fortune speed you on your way, Arisen. I am attentive and loyal, and prefer to remain by your side. In battle, I shall follow your lead and prioritize support. Should you wish to pick your foes off from afar, you need look no further than an archer, such as I. It will be an honor to serve by your side. Look, master, a treasure chest. We shall have to... Find a way to reach it. I've got wares of every ilk. Hope to see you again ere long. No purchases to be made today, I see. I just hope the shopkeep understands. Browsing! was enough to scratch the itch, in my case. A 
Fancy a gander? I find goods for sale. Much obliged. There's a ladder here. Perhaps new discoveries await us above. Plane at arisen in search of preferable treatment, you'll be sorry. Your head is like to roll ere long. Going out, are you? You sure that's a good idea? You seem rather unwell. You ought at least rest for the evening. There should be a spare bed in the lodgings yonder. Only don't go rushing off before you're ready. Take it from me. You're better off resting while you have the chance. Hoi there. You seem well tired. Tell you what, you can stay here tonight free of charge. I'll expect coin from tomorrow, mind. My pa always used to say, there's naught a good night's sleep can't fix. Not much else I can offer, I'm afraid, but you'll find all sorts at a finer inn. Aye, being armed is better than being defenseless, even if you're untrained. Still, it is worth devoting yourself to a vocation if you can. Opens up new doors, it does. You should stop by the inn in Melv if you get the chance. No hard feelings if you prefer it. They've much more to offer. We must rest, though the sun is still up. I knew it was only a matter of time before your skills reached a new height. They do say good things come to those who wait. A visit to Melv might jog your memory, Master. It seems the village yet reels from the dragon's assault. Pray, allow me to show you the way. The vanguard is yours. Lead on. I've beds to spare if you're looking for lodgings. And if you'd like to change your vocation, come see me any time.
do come again. Pray, follow. I enjoy tackling fierce foes and prefer combat's thrills to gathering items. I am confident and may act independently. Ah, oh, good. I see the Arisen's found someone to handle our busy work. That looks promising. Any ideas as to how we might reach it? Heyo. You a soldier? Could be a surprise to see you arrive in one piece if not. Hordes of monsters have been plaguing this area of late, you see. We've had to start sending out new recruits to cull them. Is that so? Who went yonder? Lachlan. But I dare say he'll fare all right. Aye, I expect he will. Who was sent out that way, then? Ocado. To be honest, sir, I'm a little worried for him. What? Weren't harpies reported in that area? Thad can't handle those beasts on his own. This is the first I'm hearing of it. Fie! I want to go to his aid, but we can't just abandon our posts. Say, you seem stout of heart. Would you be willing to go in our stead? It isn't far, only a short ways out from the main gate. You've my thanks. And Ocado's as well, I'm sure. Perhaps we ought to hurry, lest we arrive too late to be of aid. Cannot be avoided. It's fight or die. Now, I must. Get out of my way! I will protect you. We mustn't allow ourselves to become complacent. Take each trial as it comes.
ingredients are plentiful hereabouts. I say we collect as much as we can carry. Is that all of them? Yeah, you have my thanks. I do not believe for a moment I could have slain those creatures without your help. I've only just enlisted, and when I thought this could be the end of me, I... I was paralyzed. You saved me this time, but I won't always be so fortunate. I'll have to train harder, till I have the confidence to face such beasts on my own. Well, I'd best be heading back. But I'll be sure to let my superiors know of your good deed. I hope we meet again someday. We'd best report back. Over here, if you please. Thank you for healing me, Arisen. I'd hasten home, were this not my duty. Hail, friend. Many thanks for aiding Ocado. Twas a relief to see him return, and none the worse for wear. Aye, that it was. The poor sod might not have made it back alive had you not intervened. Twas a bit too early for him to be seeing actual combat. That much was made well clear. We'll be extending his training period. The instructors here are well known. <laughs> Speaking of training regimes, I must admit I've half a mind to ask you to join us. We could use someone with your experience. This ladder looks sturdy enough to climb. After you, Arisen! I'll carefully conserve my strength and endeavor to survive every battle by way of sound strategy and defensive tactics. I've beds to spare if you're looking for lodgings, and if you'd like to change your vocation, come see me any time. You shan't hear me complain about an early repose. <laughs> 